¿Cómo estás? Bienvenido a nuestros programas La Casa de Comida. Ahora para celebramos el día de 5 de mayo. Hoy nosotros cocinamos. Comina, comidas muy bien. Flan y, flan y quesadillas. Angelo, me gusta flan. ¿Y ti? Uh, sí, me gusta flan. Uh, generalmente. Uh, flan es un pastel, pero quesadillas son platas principales en México y muy popular en los Estados Unidos. Uh, también, flan y quesadillas son muy fácil para, uh, para cocinar. Vamos a cocinar, pero necesitamos comprar ingredientes. Primero, para el flan, una cartón de leche, huevos, azúcar y canela. Para las quesadillas necesito queso y tortillas. Quesadillas son muy fáciles para cocinar. Los ingredientes para cocinarlos son queso, tortillas, pollo y espacias. Quesadillas son un Tex-Mex Cuisine y son de México. Flan es muy fácil pa para cocinar también. Los ingredientes son huevos, leche, agua y azúcar. Flan es muy <laughs> delicioso y sabroso y mi familia mucho gusto. Quesadillas are a very popular dish. It is the equivalent to grilled cheese from America. Like flan, it's easy and fast to make. No one knows its origin, but we know it's still Spanish. Brought here by the fact it's made from corn tortillas native to Latin America. The cheese is brought here by the Spaniards from Europe. Put two together and there you go. It's considered Tex-Mex for this reason. The history of Mexican flan actually originates in Roman times. The word originated from the Latin root word flado, meaning flat cake. The Spanish version of this dish is sweet with caramel and sugar. The dish was brought to America by Christopher Columbus, which is how it's loved by Americans and Mexican people alike. Its adoption in Spanish culture also gave it its own dish it's cooked in, called a bain marie, which is how they cook it in Latin America and many other Spanish countries. It's a very popular dish, nonetheless. The dish has, since discovered, spread to countries around the world, such as Philippines, Vietnam, and Japan. All were still derived from the source, however. This easy, this easy made dish is very satisfying. As you can see, these two traditional dishes are loved by the Spanish community, both easy to make, but both also very satisfying.